Hi guys, so far very girl Lily. Welcome back to my channel. Asante ni sana kwa utabomu na ndela kusubscribe, comment and share. Mungu wabariki sana, sana, sana. Uh, leo, tunayamia kwenye segment ya Love Talk with I am Lily SL. Na juwa tuengi mimemisi mimi kwa ngelea mapenzi of which kwa kipindi ya pakatika tineliacha, nikawa na best sana kwenye lifestyle, kwa ya mambo ya mapishi. Lakini leo, we are back on that. Love Talk with I am Lily SL. Asa leo tunga kongile topic ya mbayo. Kuna mtu wakua maungia kwa mba lili kwa ini all the time. Unasema mwana mkia fanya nini ni mwana ume wei hivi. Kwa ni mwana mkia ni society ime besa na pitu wapa mwana mkia natakua wafanya. Kwa jili ya mwana ume. Lakini we forgot that kuna pitu wapa mwana ume pia natakua wafanya kwa mwana mkia. Right? Ili kumeka relationship be stronger. Right? Asa leo una vitu vichache ambapo wanaweza kwenda kuviagazea ya kuonyesha kwa mba vitu gani mwana ume atakia uvifanya ili uweza kumbizisha mke wako, mpenzi wako, baby wako, baby, daddy yo and all that. Kwa wanaenda kumeshe some tips, ndogo, chache, ambazo kama mtu wa kiume ukizi polo, ukizi fata, sinuweza zika kubus kwenye relationship yako. Chakwanza kitu ambacho natikia ufanya uweza kumbizisha mwana mke wako ni umpende. Yani hamna kitu ambacho watu wa kike tunapenda kama kupendwa. Yani kama mimi jamani mimi tuki nipenda jamani uwi, unanimaliza. Na kwenye mapenzi, ya tuwezi kongretu kwenye mapenzi ya maneno kwa mamta makutumia good morning text, and basi tuwa, meku nulia vitu. Yani kwenye mapenzi ya kupendwa, imigawanyika siye mingi sana. Kuna mapenzi ya vitendo na mapenzi ya maneno. Kuna watu ambuwa ku very good at speaking. Yani kukwenyesha kwa mba wana kupenda kwa maneno, kwa mdomo tu. Lakini hana vitendo vivyote. Yani yeye, Sini ni kwa bini mtu na mnagani. Kasa sisi watutu wa kike, tunapenda mtu ambaye yuko. Anawanyesha sawa mapenzi ya maneno, lakini pia anawanyesha na vitendo. Nona, eh? Kuna vitu vidogo vidogo nezo kafanya mtu wa kike, ya kawana, oh my god. Niko duniani yao nisha ingia heaven. You know, kwa hiyo vile vitu vya kumuanyesha kwa mba unampenda, kama kumpatia za wadi, vile kumuanye text, zile baby have you eaten, baby here is some tip for you, kwenda ukafanya hiki na hiki. Nujua mtu kama hive, unamusha kumbu unampenda. So maneno tu jamani. Maneno hata kwenye kanga ya hako, right? Kitu chapili jamani, we want a guy to take care of us. Sa hapa nanyo kwa mtu wa meguna, mm, mm, uneka anza. Hapana, uwe ni mstu wa kiume, uliumbwa ili utudumie sisi. Sini mauwa bwana, kama uwe ni magili maji lika pendeza, what do you think? Uwe bila kumagiliwa maji lika pendeza, lezi kupendeza, ndi mga, right? Kwa jitaini sana kumudumia mtu ambayo uko nae, iko ni kitu mwajia wapu ya vitu mbako nazo kama mwazisha mpenzi wako kumudumia kumudumia tu siku kwa maneno pia kuna watu wanaungia sana mjibu wana baby nita kundulia hiki oh baby nita kufanya hiki oh baby nita kufanya kile no saibi we are in 2020 please we need people ambao hawata ungea tunataka vitendo right take care of your girl take care of your queen take care of them the more you take care of them do oneza kwa ukawapendezesha sawa kuna ila kitu msichana watakua jitafutia mwenyewe yes we know lakini at the end of the day position na tutuwa kiume iko pale pale position na weku nundumia mimi iko pale pale I got my money but still you need to take care of me kwa hini kitu chakila mbacho unazwa kamilisha mwanamke chatatu kumweshimi Guys out here, wengi wanajisau sana kusu kumwesimu mtu wa kike. So kumbwa wamkia sumu wamia shikamo hapana. Kumwesimu mtu wa kike ni ata kwa vitendo vya kuna wabifanya. At the time ambayo yupo, ata kama akiwa hayupo. Kuna hile mtu wa kumwesimu mtu ukiwa nae kwa nye macho kama hivi. Lakini mbada sekunde mbili ukiwa lada uko semu nyingine, uko semu nyingine. Mambo wanafanya ni tofa uti. That is not what we want. We want niggas to respect us. Right? Tunataka manumi ambaya hata nieshimu, hata kama inikiwa sipo, mtu atakukia lili, your boyfriend is such a gentleman. Haizi kifanya ujinga mbele, hata kama haupo, still anaku respect. No, no, we need that. So, hile mtu, we haupo, ndo anafanya mambo ya jabu, ambo wa haileweke, anafanya mtu ambapo hafina msingi, lakini ukiwepo, yani, such a humble guy, respecting guy, and do all that shit in front of people, lakini ukiwa haupo, anafanya mambo ya jabu. We don't need that. 2020, we need guys to respect us. Kidu chane, mtoto wa kike anatakiwa, eni mwanaume, unatakiwa umuonyeshe kwamba, yeye yuko peke yake, no matter how it is. Eni, kitu ambacho nazo karabizisha mimi, nikuwenisha kwamba, eni, niko peke yangu, you, achana na kuteke ya kuni respect, kuni pende and all that, treat me like, I'm the only person you want. I'm the only person like, Eni mimi, nikipotea, eni wewe uwezi kufanya chuchote. 
Yaani kuna vitu ambavyo zile attention ambazo tunafikiri tunazitaka ni vitu vidogo sana ambavyo wewe unaweza kaona ah huu naye huu naye lakini we really love attention like seriously guys out here wasichana tunapenda attention no matter what hata akiwa na umri gani hata kama miaka 80 still we really need that hata kama miaka mingapi huko attention ya kompyuta yake kike iko pale pale mwanamke yoyote yule anataka apate attention from the guy he or she is dating or married to any attention ni kitu kikubwa sana ambacho watu wa kiume wengi wanakipotezea kwa maana kwamba ah huyu naye huyu naye hapana sometimes watu wengine we feed on attention yani kwamba kama <laughs> wanasema ka leos stars and leos tunapenda sana attention lakini sio sisi tu lakini wasichana wote wanapenda attention like seriously lakini leos tumezidi mimi jamani za i can do something ya be like oh my god did i just do this kwani nimefanya hivi kumbe i did that ili nipate attention for that time naweza nisijue kwamba nimefanya ili nipate attention ila baadaye nje kufikiria na sema why did i even do that you know that's how it is kwa hiyo watoto wa kiume kutoka kumridhisha bibi wako mpende mrespect show care to them give us attention that we need jamani we love that sawa so, kwa hivyo ni some points ambazo my point of view of what inaweza kumridhisha mtoto wa kike lakini pia last thing ambacho nisijasahau mtoto wa kike tunapenda mtu ambaye anatu support mtu ambaye anaku support in anything that you do ambaye anakupenda the way you are the ambaye ana ku support on your ideas you have something you want to do and I'm okay and I chip in on how to help like the some time when I'm baby I need this I need that I have this idea of doing business hapo nakwambia eh kwa hiyo tunafanyaje kwa hiyo tunafanyaje wapi nimekwambia ili unisaidie oh you just give me your idea of how am I supposed to do this so I'm just going to be I don't know I don't know no I don't want to hear that please what I want when I tell you something please find a way to help me out so that's the simple thing ambacho unaweza kufanya kwa your baby your baby mama your darling your wife your baby your boo boo whatever you call them any name you name them that's what you can do kuweza kumridhisha sisi ni we are talking ni viumbe ambavyo tuko very sensitive weak loving and ini Mungu alitumba tofauti and it's very easy to deal with us that's why i think niggas find it i mean very easy to play with girls feelings some sisi ni viumbe ambavyo we are very weak uh when it comes to love like in other parts we are not that we are not that way like in i think that that generation this generation you know talking about trakike they can stand for themselves hata kama kwa mambo ya mapenzi we are not like kuonyesha kwamba we are this weak no we don't do that so hivi watu tunaanza kujifunza kwamba mtoto wa kike anaweza ka stand for themselves they can do this if this is wrong they move away that's what we want lakini sio kwamba tunafungwa in one cage and forget why amba we are women and we can do better sawa so, so niggas out here my boys uh these are the simple things I'm going to talk about to communicate with the new wako. So, thank you so much for watching this video. Let's meet another time on Love Talk with I am Lily SL, Cooking with Lilian Lema, and all other segments in here. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, and share. I love you all. God bless you all.